video, I'm going to show you how you can create a simple boat animation using the Explore Lab animator interface. To access that, go into the art menu and then animator. From here, you have a blank canvas to draw on. Your drawing tools and palette are on the right hand side. So we're going to start by selecting a color for our ocean. And I'm going to do the dark blue at the top. And then from my toolbar, I'm selecting the rectangle tool or the square looking button. That will allow me to click on my canvas and draw a rectangle of any dimension. In this case, it will be my ocean. So I'll have it fill just about the bottom half of my frame. Now for the top section, I'm going to use the light blue and I can either use that same rectangle tool or click on the paint bucket to fill it with one click. Now that we have our background, we need to add our boat. Down at the bottom of the screen, you can see three little boxes that represent different layers you can work on. If you click on the middle one, you will move into the second layer. Choose a color for your boat and then use the line tool to draw it in. Now I'm going to go for sort of a simple sailboat shape that's smaller on the bottom and larger at the top. I'm going to give mine a mast and then using a contrasting color, a sail. So you'll notice with this line tool, I can very easily just draw straight lines down to create my shapes. I could also use the pencil icon at the top and that will sort of just fill wherever I draw with the color of my choosing. Once you have your first frame, you'll see you have your boat on one layer and then your ocean on the layer behind. Now down in the bottom frame menu here, we'll be able to see all of the frames that we create, as well as what the two layers look like combined. Once I'm happy with my base drawing, I can click on it and click duplicate. That will create a copy of the final frame of my animation. Once I've done that, I want to take the move tool. That's the bottom right one in your toolbar and it looks like a cross with arrows going on all four sides. Now using the move tool, I'm going to simply move my boat up a single pixel. Then I'm going to duplicate my frame again. With the move tool still selected, bring my new frame back down to where the starting frame was. One more time, click on the last image, click duplicate, and then move my boat down one pixel. Now the way the Explore Lab interface works, I will then, whatever frames I build, will start cycling automatically. So I can choose how fast my animation is playing back using this on the left hand side and then the play button down below my canvas to see it in action. So now you can see I have created a very simple bobbing boat animation. If I'd like to send that to my Explorers, I can click the upload button, it will process and then the animation will send it right here to my Explorers device. Thanks so much for watching and congratulations on completing your very first animation of a boat in Explorer Lab.